top. So, newest product in the mail. It is Universal Lox Detangling Brush. Safety first, so it must be for kids. When I saw this, I literally thought it was for dogs. Because it looks like a dog brush. So, literally feeding a baby as we're going through this. Um, adjustable bar slides up for thin hair and down for thicker hair. Interesting. So, ouch free. Sorry, I'm feeding a baby. Um, this is something I've never seen before. So, we're going to open it up, take a look, and I'll come back with more info. I got it out of the wrapper. Here's the brush. Um, the picture shows, you know, depending on different hair lengths, you can make it wider or less, but it, it doesn't tell you anything else. So I guess maybe the wider is for thicker hair. It literally says, wash the detangling brush in hot water, rinse with warm water, let air dry. That is the only instructions. That's kind of ridiculous. And then of course the back has like where it's made and blah, blah, blah. So, okay, oh, I dis disregard. On the front, right there, it says adjustable bar. Slides up for thinner hair and down for thicker hair. So, we all have thick hair in this house. So we're gonna slide it down. And this will be the setting we use. Obviously, my hair is up. But I'm gonna try this on Kennedy when she gets home. So we shall see if this is a great brush for detangling. Um, the picture does show more of like wavy hair, so I don't know if that makes a difference. We do have thick hair and tends to be frizzy because it's thick. I think it really wants to curl, so, um, but it's too heavy. So we'll be back with Kennedy trying the Safety Brush, Safety First Universal Locks Detangling Brush, and I'll let you know. We'll, we'll let her tell you how it works. Coming back on the brush. Um, so I didn't test it on anybody yet, but we're gonna test it now. Kennedy, I need you. So again, this is a universal locks detangling brush. Yeah. We're gonna detangle. As you can see, this looks lovely. I do not like the way it feels so far. I'll tell you that right now. It feels very chintzy. Here, take your pony out and brush your hair. See how it feels. Do it in front of the camera so they know for real. I just don't like the way it like feels very plasticky. Oh yeah, this is bad. Okay, so That's a brush. attitude on a little child. Um, but she's sampling it as a detangling brush and she's not a fan that's negative out free stars. out free not so much now we're gonna see about um negative 10 stars okay we're gonna see how it works with wet hair maybe that's the intended purpose it says nothing about that on the packaging but that'll be our next try so we'll be back um my hair is just brushed so it's not bothering me but for her it was really not so nice so and it is not out. Ow. I do have some knots and it's it's not out free. So we'll be back with wet hair. <laughs> so I didn't get to come back to try the brush um, with wet hair. It really feels very plastic and cheaply made. Not like a brush would feel nice and sturdy. This almost felt like, like a dollar store spatula. Like the just the way it felt. So I, I wasn't even going to deal with the wet hair and, and try. I know I said I was going to, but it doesn't look like a normal brush. It looks like something out of this world. <laughs> so I'm not even going to waste my time with it. And quite honestly, I don't even know where it is now because I think we were just so annoyed by that brush and how like crappy it didn't work, how crappy it made us feel that we're like, forget it. So um, don't. I don't know who would buy this thing. It's a piece of crap. <laughs> so that's my take on that brush. We did not like it at all. It didn't help with anything. And there was no instructions either. So they're lost. They should have put better instructions. So anyways, if you're interested, Walmart. <laughs> have a good one. And um, thank you for watching.